Hello, so today I'm going to show you some stuff I picked up this week and this week I had some sales so what we're going to do is I'll try and stick to it if I remember you know what it's like every week by the end of the week Sunday or Saturday we will do a calculation the tally up I will show you what what sold that week basically obviously in the summer when it's car boot sale um, season whatever you want to call it there will be more to show more sales you know as it's near Christmas literally a few days and stuff like that sales will be minimum for me because I haven't got much so I'll show you what we uh, what we've picked up here and then go to my computer and I'll show you what sold so did a bit of research well I did anyway I kind of prepared myself so more professional so let's start it might be a fail it might be profit you know what eBay's like sometimes with the sale comps they could be up and down all over the place and then you've got to try and work out and pick what makes sense and what's not real and that stuff so this is the Breaking Bad complete series obviously it doesn't have uh, the film which is part of the series um, El Camino I think it's called or something like that and what we got one two three four five final yeah I believe this is the whole lot so this was a uh, five pound which is they're from um, Scope, I think that was. It was a lot of money. You know, their prices like, you know what charity shop prices are like at the moment. eBay prices basically, but sometimes you're lucky, which we'll get to something in a minute. But yeah, as I was uh, saying, so this was five pound and the comps, I saw one, when I looked at it, I saw one what sold for like just under 20 quid. So I was like, okay, five pound into 20 pound or, you know, 19 18 not too bad but then i was looking at some more comps and they're basically 10 pound 12 pound 8 pound so i don't know we can see we might list it you know in the middle so it's between 10 and 20 if you know what i mean 15 in the middle so i'll probably put it for like 12 15 and go from there really i highly doubt that i'll get anywhere near that because that just doesn't seem realistic to me for a box set of dvd dvds and not many people these days buy DVDs, so that's just my thought. But yeah, it's all there, complete, not too bad. And it's worth watching the series, if you haven't, Breaking Bad. Cool. This is a pretty cool find. So this is for me old uh, blue tits, because I like blue tits and birdies. So this is a, oh God, reading, not my stronghold. Whatever that says, Trex, Trex, E, well, you can read it. And it looks German or something, or... Whatever that is. So, but basically, this is a brand new bird box. Um, yeah, look at the way they're building it. That's pretty cool. A bit weird. But yeah, this is a brand new. Obviously, it's been like kind of open, but not used. A bit wear on the box, but I've checked and it's brand new, not been built. There's one comp on sales for $16.99, brand new, which is basically this one. So. We're put up for that price and we'll send out some offers if people watch it or something like that. But yeah, that's not too bad. I paid, that's the main thing you want to know. Ah, I paid, the old camera angle. I paid £4 from Scope, so it's not too bad. £4 into... 16 99 17 quid, 15 quid. Not too bad. I like that kind of uh, return. And then postage shouldn't be too bad. In the, uh, we could put that in the air mailer. Um, bubble wrap it. Send it with uh, um, whatever they're called, Hermes, whether or not they're called something else. I can't think what they're called now, but you know what I mean. So yeah, that's pretty good. Um... We'll leave the best till last. So, today, day of filming, I picked up this. And, you know, well, you know, Skylanders and these... Yeah, they're Skylanders. Some of them, a lot of them are worth nothing. But I've watched a lot of reselling video, a lot of gaming videos and people. The, I believe the ones with the diamond plate, this bit, not all of them, I think some of them, vary in price but the ones you want to look out for the ones the diamond plates they're the ones what are worth money and this one i paid 
99p. This is from the British Heart Foundation. And this is called something buckshot. And I saw some comps for £15, like top end. So anywhere between 10 and 15 really in, it, in between. So that's not too bad for a quid. So that's a good return. That get bubble wrapped, put in a little bag. Air mailer, tiny one. Or if I have a jiff, yeah, air mailer. Because if I put it in a paper jiffy, it just ripped through. So that's not too bad. I could probably set a CX, but they'd give me like probably like five quid for it, maybe. Probably something like that, so there's no point. And then I'll just buy video games. But we'll rather sell that, keep the profit, save the money, buy more stuff, and sell more stuff. Let's go to this one. So, why up the old bro kit? Doesn't matter. So this is Tracy's Island Thunderbirds 90s electronic. Apparently it makes a noise. I think so. Or so it's electronic. But these come out. This is from Thunderbirds. This comes out. But it's not complete because it's missing the Thunderbirds toys itself. And it's also missing the heads off the palm trees. So it looks weird. It looks like some kind of tentacle alien thing. But this was spares and repairs. I saw it last thing at the charity shop for they kicked me out because it was closing time. 199. That was the cheapest thing I found there, so I was like, yep, I'll take that. I don't really think about posting it in the future because that's gonna be a bit of a nightmare. But it just needs a good old clean, which is easy, and yeah, it's just missing the toys. The figurines. Yeah, batteries under that. It doesn't look broken anywhere. It just looks like well, it doesn't look like it is missing, like the Thunderbirds itself and other bits and bobs and then these. But yeah, so if this was complete in box, it's about £40, maybe a bit more. I saw some comps. Um, this on its own, I could probably maybe easy-ish, if I'm lucky, get a tenner for it. But it might be slightly less because of these palm trees. But worse comes to worse. Take it to the car boot sale in the summer and someone can have it for a fiver. So yeah, or if you want to buy it, let me know. But yeah, unfortunately, it's missing these palm trees. So yeah, there it is. Cool. After t uh, testing Tracy's Island and expecting the battery tray, it, uh, there was batteries in there. They were exploded, corroded. And one of the terminals broke, so that's a no good. After looking on eBay, I found listings for spares and repairs, which makes sense. And they were selling these three separately, so this goes for about six quid. I could be wrong. I'll put it up here. This was um, about a fiver, and then this was on for about seven pounds, I think. And they all sold. There was comps. So that's pretty good. So one ninety nine. Can't resell that. Too much hassle. That's missing. Palm trees, they sell those separately if they were there. You know, and then yeah. So the battery tray's not fixable really. So that's a bust that probably go in the bin or keep it for the car boots so I can have that. But I've got these free listed, so that'll make my money back easy. So that was a pretty good uh investment i guess it in in a way so i was pretty lucky at that so yeah i should have checked it when else i was there but they were closing and it was just a quick pickup but for 199 can't really say no so yeah thumbs up so that's what i picked up really this week let's go to my computer and show you what's sold okay we're at the computer so it's nice and warm here radio's on so i bought a glastonbury 50 year anniversary book I believe this one here I paid a pound for it so up for 10 pound plus postage so that's pretty good and the next one is hopefully you can see guys it's not too dark or blurry whatever um, I bought basically a bundle of um, night garden toys because um, you know me I, I basically buy a bit of any, anything really except really clothes and shoes and stuff but yeah I've bought a bundle and I uh, sold a Ninky Nonk train, whatever you want to call it, for a fiver. That actually sold within less than an hour with a listing. So that's good. Um, and then I sold uh, 
another big box PC game. Because I bought them last, no, this year from someone at no car boot sale for quid each. I bought 40 odd and I've been sending them through the year at different prices like £10, £15, all that. So, yeah, made good profit. And today I sent an offer out. Well, some, mm, yeah, sent an offer out. That was at twelve ninety nine, and then I sent an offer for ten pound, and they accepted it. And that is Night Garden Ninky Donk Train again, and the figurines in the back. And I just realised something. Actually, no, that's it. Yeah, so that's not too bad to start. So we sold uh, one, two, three items of the stuff that I picked up today. Well, sorry, this week. So it's not too bad, is it? Not a million there yet, but we're getting there. So start, start at Christmas kind of thing, you know? Next year, with the boot sales is going to be good. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed that video. That's basically how it's going to be. Sorry about that, I've got rain nose. Winter, cold. You know, so basically, these videos are going to be like this. The I will show you what I sold. I will show you what I picked up. We'll show you how much they're worth and all that stuff. That's basically going to be the premise, is that the word, of the videos of when I do the eBay videos. And then obviously when we go car boot sales, chest mount, charity shops if I can and stuff like that. So hopefully you enjoy this content and leave it a like, follow, all that good stuff. And don't forget all the gaming stuff, videos, collecting is still in this channel. And will be coming soon. For some reason I'm talking funny. And I can't think what I've got to say. But yeah. I think I'm tired. It's been a busy week at work. But yeah. So hopefully you like that. That's pretty cool. That um, Tracy's Island. It's a shame that it's not complete. I remember as a kid. Um, on TV. Them advertising this. I think because I was born in the 90s. Or oh, someone had one. And I remember playing it. I don't know. But this actually is very familiar to me. But yeah, it's just missing the parts, which is pain. My voice went funny. It's a pain, but it's just the way it is. So yeah, so hopefully we can get £10 and then figure out how to post it in the future when it happens. It's going to be fun. So probably need a box. So yeah, cool. I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, uh, next video I've sold more stuff. Well, it'll probably be Christmas by then, but from me, hopefully you have a good Christmas. If I don't see you... We'll speak to you now, I will speak to you after Christmas, so yeah, have a good Christmas. If not, I'll try and get a video up beforehand, okay? Like normal, stop jabbering, stop talking, rubbish, let's go. In a bit, goodbye, goodbye. Where are all the pieces? God damn it, I did lose them. Goodbye. Okay,